Hello friends, welcome to the channel again. Thanks for watching our travel videos. As you can see, today we have a different view, different view of Hobart. In my background, we can see the Mount Wellington, the horizon and several suburbs of Hobart. It's a beautiful city. And as you know, recently we are adding some beautiful sceneries of Hobart in front of our old videos. And so today we have a different location. We are at the Deck Hotel, an open deck restaurant on fourth floor of Crown Plaza in Hobart. And we have a fascinating view from that place. It's a beautiful place to eat and enjoy the view of Hobart. So let's move on to today's video. Today's video is about Kulangata, Tweed's Head in New South Wales. It's a beautiful town at the border of Queensland and New South Wales states of Australia. There is a point of interest in Kulangata where you can basically stand both sides of the border. On one side you have Queensland and other side you have New South Wales. So it's a fascinating place partly because it's covering two states and also you can go to the sea beach and it's a surfer's paradise. A lot of surfers enjoy the sunny weather and extraordinary waves all day long. So we had a good time there. We walked around to it says Kulangata and we had a good time recording a lot of surfers doing extraordinary movements on huge waves. So please enjoy this video. Welcome to Tweed Heads and Kulangata, a stunning coastal paradise where history, culture and natural beauty collide. Today we are exploring the heart of this region, the war memorial and diving into the vibrant world of Tweed Heads dedicated surfers. Kulangata is a coastal suburb in the city of Gold Coast in Queensland. It is the Gold Coast southernmost suburb and its borders with New South Wales. On the other hand, Tweed Heads is a coastal town at the mouth of the Tweed River in the Northern Rivers region of the New South Wales. Tweed Heads is the northernmost town in New South Wales and is in the Tweed Shire local government area. After a short walk, we visited the border marker between the two states, Queensland and New South Wales, dividing the twin towns. During COVID lockdowns, locals in these two towns had a tough time crossing this border, as two states on the both sides of this border closed their borders. Look at the street name, Boundary Street. Imagine crossing this border. Today it feels like COVID was a bad nightmare a long time ago, perhaps a distant memory. Winter time in Queensland is the most fabulous time of the year. It's the dry season, not too hot, almost always spotless sunshine. It was a beautiful day, so it was a nice day for walking. After a short walk from the border street up the hill, we reached a viewpoint and the view was just magnificent. Tweed Heads and Kulangata, located on the border of New South Wales and Queensland, offer a unique blend of laid-back coastal vibes and rich history. On top of the hill, there was a war memorial. The war memorial stands as the solemn tribute to those who made the ultimate sacrifice for their country. As we stand before this monument, let's take a moment to remember their bravery and honor their memory. But in Kulangata or Tweed Heads, it's not all somber reflection here. The energy of the surfers is palpable. The waves of Tweed Heads have long been a playground for these passionate riders. With the crystal clear waters and perfect breaks, it's no wonder the surfers from all over the world flock to this point. Whether you are a seasonal pro or just catching up your first wave, the surfer culture here is infectious. Beautiful sunny day, blue water, with so many brave surfers breaking the huge waves, they made our recordings full of drama, a wonderful experience. Although we don't surf, 
but this amazing view was best subject for our photography on the day. Although we captured many dramatic moments while surfers were showcasing their water acrobatics on the day, for the short video, we just made a 3 minutes long collection, a compilation of the best moments that we could capture. Please enjoy this part of the video. It was an immersive and indulging experience, to be honest. Gold Coast skyline was fully visible throughout the day, anywhere we stand. Weather was just spotless. Gorgeous sunny weather made the day beautiful, enhancing the experience with the surfers. We could see the Gold Coast Airport and continuously flights were leaving Gold Coast Airport. So during the lunch, I made nearly 50 different shorts on plane spotting. We hope to share those plane spotting shorts on our YouTube channel over time at some point. We had our lunch at the Tweed Head Surfers and Life Saving Club. The club was established in 1909. View from the open balcony of the club was just stunning. Fish and chips tasted much sweeter after a long 3-4 hours walk on the sea beach and enjoying the breathtaking views and the surfers. Walking on the Kulangata promenade in the late afternoon was mesmerizing, the perfect way of ending the day. There were light breeze, local footy players were running on the beautiful beach, the gentle waves. We had a wonderful time at this special place. So friends, we had an immersive experience today with the streets, sands and waves of Tweed Heads and Kulangatta, a place where past and the present create an unforgettable experience. Hope you enjoyed the short video. Stay safe and goodbye until the next video.